this is Mikey 1000 and today, well, I did a yard sale. I've been doing a yard sale here and there, but I was like, well, you know, there are people that are looking for Christmas gifts and, you know, they might see my video and you might find something on here that you might be interested in. Some of the stuff is my mom's and it was my dad's and my mom, of course, lives with me and we don't need it. So I got some little things here so I could mail them. I'll wrap them up and mail them to you if you're interested um, let me know so I'm gonna show you what I got and uh, you know we'll just see see if you're interested um, I have sold some stuff um, as much as I'd like to because I just have too much stuff just too much and I have a very small house and I had to bring all her stuff here so I'm trying to get rid of it because it needs to go it really does so I mean some of this stuff would be great gifts you know so I'm gonna show you what we got and here we go so she's got some stuff here um, Christmas little ornament I like the little ball and I was thinking if nobody buys this yeah, that you could put like candy in there or something like that. I would redo this. I would probably paint it back and maybe put some other ornaments on it. All they are is those sticky things, you know. You could do that. I might do that if I don't get rid of it. So, and she's got bells. She used to have a bell collection, so she's been getting rid of her bells. There's a Christmas one. This one's from Canada, New Brunswick. Uh, on a trip that we did and you know she's got one here from Las Vegas as she did um, we got this Duck Dynasty I don't remember how I got it or where I got it um, yeah so um, anybody interested in that it's a Monopoly great game in fact it has Monopoly on it see and it's a Duck Dynasty Redneck Windsor um, yeah, so I think that's pretty cool. Might be a nice gift for somebody. I got some candle sticks here, little candle holders. I got some, I, I think I, I'm going to do, I didn't sell these candles and they're falling apart. Um, I think I'm going to melt them down and I might do a video on it. I think that's what I'm going to do with these. Now this one, you know, it's don't know what happened to the other one. Hey, how are you? I'm okay, hanging in there. <laughs> okay. No, I'm doing video. I'm trying to get rid of as much as I can. I need money. <laughs> yeah, yeah. And I got a candy dish here. This is cute. I thought that was pretty. And um, she's got a little man here. A little, little guy here. And a uh, little plastic container. This is plastic. Um, you could put anything in it. You could put flowers in it and make an ornament out of it if you wanted to. She's got this little coffee pot. Teapot, sorry. A little teapot here. It's not real, I don't think so. In fact, I think she got it from a yard sale, she said. And I got my dad's pajamas here. He wore them only a few times. He got these at Walmart, so... Um, you know, I was trying to get rid of these. Let me see what size they are. There you go. They're 2X. They're, they're for men. Women well, could wear these too if you wanted to. Um, we don't really need them down here that much, but, uh, you know, he was getting older. He was getting cold. So, he was getting pretty, pretty cold. So, his poor circulation made him cold. So, that's why. And she got this little tub thing, which would be a great... Um, you know, thing to use for for a craft or something, or for a gift, you could put all kinds of stuff in it and wrap it up. It would be really a cute thing to have. Here's some hats. They were my father's. Cute little hats here. Well, I put this one up here. Try to can't get this side to curl up though, but I think you could if you worked on it a little bit. Yeah, they were in storage so much. There's a bunch of hats down here. I got some Canadian hats in here too. Um, this one is number 20. And I have the Dale Earnhardt Jr. 
And I also have this hat here, Bike Week. It was 2005, Daytona Beach. And then we have a lot of these little hats that have Canada on them, Canadian Molson on them. He wore these when he was doing the yards. Um, they had a lawn service business there for a while. And these are uh, in Molson, Canadian ones. Um, got a Toronto Maple Leaf hat for hockey. Must be the hockey thing. Yep, hockey. Because we're Canadians, so they had a lot in here. This one was for my dad's job where he lived it in Canada. He worked for Hayes Dana Corporation. That's what it is here in the States. But in Canada, it's called Hayes Dana. So he worked for them, and he got a hat with Hayes Dana on it. He used it quite a bit, too. Oh, gosh. Anyways, I got these lovely glasses, mugs, here. And they have little things on the back of them. I don't know if you can see that. I can barely read it. I can't even read what it says. But they're all got the, the chip on them. Look pretty good. Just got a little plate here to serve, serving plate. And then you can put your dipper in there and put chips around the side. She got her little cookie jar. She got a cookie jar here. Um, yeah. Snowman cookie jar. Got this little candy dish here. Little candy thing. And she's got her her uh, mixer. This is a vintage mixer. I have one, so I didn't need it. And she's had this for many years. This is by Sunbeat Mixer. So, and it's got the two things worth it. So, and we have some other stuff here. I'm not going to really go over it too much. Um, if you're interested in that, this is Shea Bear stuff. So, um, I'm just going to show you, and if you're interested in it, you can contact him or me, and we'll give you prices and stuff on any of the stuff you're interested in. We have the, uh, we have some uh, DVDs here that we're selling. These go really good. The, between these and the knives, we do well. So, yeah, so between these and this. Yeah, we do pretty good. We really are don't have that much left of them. We used to have a bunch of these. Bunch, a bunch, bunch. So anyways, that's what I got here. That I can mail some of it. Um, yeah, that, you know, so I just thought maybe somebody out there might be interested in something. Um, yeah, so I also have a Canadian flag here. I sold one yesterday, and I have one here. So, if anybody's interested in a Canadian flag, never know. So, anyways, I just thought I'd show that off, and, uh, yeah. I haven't had a good day today. It's been crappy out, so. And it's Sunday, so a lot of people aren't really doing anything. So, uh, you know, the crappy day, they don't go anywhere. And yesterday was a Christmas parade. I didn't do that well, but I made a little bit. So to me, if I get rid of something, it's better than keeping it. So, you know, um, I'm going to try to sell them on the corner, I think. It's going to be my first time down there since uh, we had had to stop because of the virus. So, um, yeah, I'm going to try to go back down there, I think. And see, it's just as hard because you gotta lug all this stuff down there and you gotta take it out and set it all up and then you wait and then you gotta take it out, gotta take it and put it in the car and then bring it back here and then gotta take it out again. Here, at least I can put it up and I can take it back down and put it away. You know, it's not as hard. Um, and also, if I you go to the bathroom or I want something to eat or drink, I can do that. You know, it's kind of nice here. But I think also that a lot of people won't turn down this street because it's inconvenient. So if you make it convenient for them. And the store is open down there now. So, um, yeah, I think I'm going to try down there on Wednesday. There's other vendors that have been down there on Wednesday. And uh, so I wanted to see if uh, 
I can do it again. Let's see how well it works. <coughs> we used to go down there all the time. <coughs> and it does make a difference. You know, people will have to turn down a road. It's inconvenient. But if they're just driving straight, and a lot of them, or the way the driveway is there, they don't even have to get a car that can just drive like a drive through yard sale. So, anyways, so, anything that you might be interested in, um, you know, that you've seen, yeah, <coughs> um, just let me know. Okay? And I hope you all have a great rest of the week. I got a couple of videos I think I'm going to do this week. Um... Yeah, so, well, we'll check and see. Probably be near the end of the week, though. Yeah. And then my grandbaby's supposed to come next Sunday, so to open up her Christmas gifts. So that will be fun. That will be really fun. Yep. Okay, so stay tuned for more. Monkey says she's out for now. Bye, y'all. Thank you.